Atreus, this way. Best of luck. It seems like me, the Valyrs, locked down because of us. Mm. Outsiders are not welcome here. I imagine that large statue of Odin has something to do with it. Well, everyone's hiding on this side, too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. The tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking on some doors for directions. Sorry to bother you. If you're you. selling something, please bugger off. If you're not selling something, uh, please kindly bugger off. This looks promising, right? Well, that's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You? Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <clears throat> None taken. Good point, though. You think that's him? Hello? Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Derlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Derlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there, and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. But he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here, please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful compass. Now scamper off.
Come. A boat cannot be far. Huh. Really, your Sindri made it sound like Derlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Was being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Derlin's. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? So, we're going to Derlin's? Makes sense. We could always explore those mining rigs later. This is the safety office? Well, the sign a hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. We're looking for Derlin? Do you have an appointment? Uh, no? Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> Here to collect on something, pal? Think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <laughs> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get it? You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I... Wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, got it, got it. Failed. Faye is dead. Best of them all. left alive have to pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfheim from the Aesir. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Like this. 
What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the All Father's given name and, uh, uh, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Play it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Dina? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Hey, this isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Directions. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smelled him? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Ah, dear! Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight.
This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. I think we need some special equipment to use this. name I don't miss hearing. No one said it until you did, just now. Darling, he didn't need to say it, brother. It was written all over his face. Uh, well, burned, I should say. Into his head. He burned that into Derlin's head? Failed rebellions tend to warrant swift and enduring retribution. He is a captain of Odin. Aye, and the bearer of Galahorn. A true believer, that one. There are few things so dangerous in a man as lack of doubt. like we're here. Come on. This way. I can see another train. Let's look for a way to get over there. You know, maybe finding Tyr is our best protection. Seemed like Odin really didn't want us to find it. Once Tyr's free and can be God of War again, Odin won't have time to worry about us. If that is his war to fight, he may have it. Deactivated, but yes. Likely one belonging to Bari, the dwarf, builder of the Great Hall, Lua. We may need some special equipment to use this. I don't think this is working, brother. Maybe we should come back. Whoa! Is that a Trekkie? What happened here? Use caution. I think it's dead. Yep. Definitely dead. Hey, I wonder if... Atreus! Damn, watch out! <laughs> <laughs>
Think that Drekius will kill the first one we found? If so, it was their aggression that got them both killed. Down there, I can see a mine. That has to be what Derlin was talking about. Tracks up on the left there. Might be another train we can take. Father, what if a war with Odin isn't just tears to fight? What if it's ours too? War is not the only way. We're gods. Better gods. We're trying to stop Ragnarok. To help us here. And what if the only way to do that is war? Atreus. Ahead. Unintended, I imagine. Just keep coming from that pillar. Looks like a mess. If you destroy the nest, we might stop coming. On your left. Looks like we have to get this one back on the track. thing is small. Okay, we need to go left. Wait, I meant my left. Keep going. We're so close, just a little to the left. Hmm, hopefully that's it. That's way too far. Mimir, tell him left. We're so close, just a little to the left. Yeah, that's it. Round two, here we go. <sighs> Kraken Hatchling gave you a stone. Kraken? Oh, uh, Diener. Yeah, it's covered in algae. I was thinking we could show it to Brock and Sindri when we got back. Here. Okay, so, we came here looking for Tyr because we don't trust Odin, right? If you think about it, war could... Uh-oh. On your left! Tell me when! 
Atreus! Look for a brace to stop the train! We should be a lever of some sort! Damn it! Uh, the brake's stuck! Keep trying, little brother! Father! Stop this train! I think it's about to... No! Get up! Father! A troll? I can't believe you. Are you serious? Watch your right! Said it, little boy. This place is incredible. The whetstone of the Night Ripper. When resisting an occupation, sometimes the most obvious methods are the best. It is old. No longer of use. But enough about you. I'm talking about the whetstone. Go! 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 
So, quite the mouth you had on the train, lad. It's just a word. I've heard way worse from... The word does not matter. You lost control. We were falling through the air. I thought we were gonna die. Is that what you truly wish your last word to be? No. In moments of crisis, panic does nothing. Harness it. Let it serve you. leading to the mine. We'll need to get past this cargo. Hey, looks like you stopped the water flow on that trough. That's it. Let's head across. nor near chest. Aye, but no seals to destroy or bells to ring. These are different. There's a brazier to the left of the chest. Maybe you can light it? Good bet there's a couple more near here. Let's find them, yeah? Cooperative in large scare quotes. I might be able to get up there if you help me. Great! I'll head across for a better look. Father, there's a gate up here heading towards the entrance to the mine. If you can get up here, I'll need your help lifting it. If. Oh, come on! You can jump that! Your knees aren't that bad. Atreus. I hope you can make that jump! It's another one of those wooden troughs. I wonder how the dwarfs got a stuff like this. Aye. Might be the great motivator of convenience. Why do the work when you can get the wet stuff to do it for you?
Frontier's here. Atreus, we seek information. I know. Go! Oh! On your side, I will lift on mine. <laughs> Heavier than I thought. Mm. Thanks. Let's keep moving. We well, found Darlin's mine entrance. Got something else for you, Sindri. What is it? Since you're currently lacking a light source. Sorry, and have no way of seeing exactly what untold horrors lurk in the dark. These will help. Okay, back to your exploring now. Off with you. Thanks, Sindri. Hey, wait, what do you mean by untold horrors? This is it. This is the mine. Intriguing. However, we're ill-equipped to do anything with it right now. Another way. This way. Nice. Not a dead end. Come on. Let's see where this goes. Ugh, these guys are dead. On your right. Watch your left. Where are they all coming from? It certainly smells like we're headed into a mine. I think I can hear the water, too. Slow down, Atreus. Take care. Be ready. So, I think I found where those righteous were coming from. They will overwhelm you quickly. Stay close! It's a bear trap. Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. For her, it will be so. Oh! Oh! Thank you, watch out. Oh! 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 Oh
I'm sorry. I know you said not to, but I can't stop thinking about this. We spend all of our time fighting bad stuff, and I don't get why we can't do that alongside Tyr. We do not know him. We saw his shrines. He's a leader. He stood up to Odin when no one else would. If he's done it before, why wouldn't he do it again? Images from long ago do not tell a whole story. There's a door. Once we get off this, let's check there for Tyr. He's gotta be close. I can't help but feel like you're angry with me or something. Ever since we got to Sparto Farm, you've been critical of my every move. If you don't think I can lead us, just say so. It is not your competence that is in question. Okay, but what does that mean? Consider your intent. This place is huge. Must have taken ages to build. Another door. We'll have to check that one too. Your instructions do not say which one. Nope, we're on our own here. Your question from before, about my intent. I intend to help the God of War stop Odin. And that means freeing him from whatever prison he's in right now. Brace yourselves, friends. Sindri? Oh. And be careful exiting that thing. One foot at a time, there are loose, rusty nails everywhere. Have you seen any signs? By the way, if you're headed to the mining rigs in the bay, could you bring me any slag you find? I could use the... Be safe! Look, there's a door just across this gap. Tear could be right there. Whoever wrote this certainly had an eye for detail. The water flows blocked. Cool. to the door. Come on. Tyr? Well, I certainly don't think this is where Tyr currently is. He, he's got to be here somewhere. This mine is huge. Atreus, what do you intend to stop Odin from doing? You speak as if you know his plan. I don't know his plan. That's why we're... Um, brothers. With Fimblewinter underway and Ragnarok around the corner, Odin will be desperate. Whatever he's planning to do surely won't be to the benefit of anyone but himself. Exactly. A 
Across the way, there's another door. Maybe that's the one. <laughs> Did you see that over there? How many doors are there down here? Not to be discouraging, but it is a mine after all. Namir, that is discouraging. Josh, the broken door up to the left behind his crank. Maybe Tyr tried to escape. We should look. Maybe you can use those wheels somehow. Powered up. We're almost there. That sounded like it wasn't quite right there, brother. Outstanding! That overflowing water is burning the crane. Clever. We'll be up there in no time. Exercise. Let's think about how Tyr's probably feeling locked up in this mine. If I were imprisoned by Odin and finally freed, Odin would obviously be at the top of my list. But I would just want to fight him. Anything. Even if it was just to know I still could. Tyr? Whoa! What happened here? Certainly weren't tear. Best look around. This dwarf didn't make it out. Is that a relic? Huh. Go! 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 
Alright, give him what for. Might be able to get out of here this way. Another empty vault. Ahem. Little brother. Perhaps it's time no, we. Don't even say it. We're gonna find him. Look, another door on the other side of the cavern. Let's go. Yeah. Up there. The path keeps going. We'll just have to get across. Wait. Is that the same one we've seen before? That works. Do you believe we're above where we got off the boat by Sindri? This mine is one enormous spiral. Should be clear now. Ready when you are. One more door. That one has to be it. We will see. Seems like we'll have to get to it first. A crank over here. Atreus, another mental exercise. Okay, it looks like this machine is dropping ore into the water drop. It's gotta be it. We still have to go back and check out that last door, right? Familiar. We're back in the spiral section of the mine. I think I can hear something in there. Jump him. Did you hear that, brothers? I think we're alone. Ears open. Eyes up. It came from over here. There's a passage leading out.
Atreus, do my words irritate you? It's fine. I get it. Bravas. Wait, is that light up ahead there? Hey, this might be it. That door's barred. They must be trying to keep something in. You don't lock a door like that to secure the spare bedclothes. I see what we must do. Do it then. Come on, Father, you can do it. game do you play with me now? We're not with Odin. We're the good guys. Away. Rather let me try. Dear. Dear. Look, you know me, don't you? You. You killed Mimir. No. No, 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 no. Yeah, we, we brought him right back. Yeah. Stay away from me, you monsters. Stop. We need him. I 
near them. Find your son. Leave me alone. Tyr, listen, I swear we're not here to hurt you. We're just trying to get, get you away out. From me, please. Take you somewhere safe I away from you. Odin. Show mercy. This is my father. We help people. I don't belong out here, please. It's worse when he's angry. Are you not a soldier? Are you not a leader of men? Master yourself! My son brought us to this place. For you! Look at him! You? Why? You don't know me. I know what you stood for. You helped the giants for returning the favor. We? We are leaving. Are you coming with us? statue in the lake. You had a spear. I thought you needed a weapon. Walking stick? No. A kind thought, but no. Thank you, no. But... Okay. I, uh... I, I ran because I don't always know what's real. Sometimes there's a... There's no shame in that, brother. We live in strange times. Everyone hears him talk. We must return home. Feel that? A wind blowing from over here. Maybe there's an exit nearby. Are there names by which I should call you? I'm Atreus. You already know I'm here. And that's my father, Kratos. How does the son of a Spartan come to speak for the Yotnar? My mother was the last giant in Midgard. Laufey? Laufey. I remember that name. She tried to help people too. She's in the light of Alphine now. You have my sympathies.
Please, let me get that. It's the least I can do. Whoa. Why risk Odin's wrath to free me? Well, Ragnarok is coming. I hope you knew that. We thought you'd want to help. You freed me only to start a war? No! Um... Um... Sotia, it's good to see you in the flesh again. Namir, what's become of you? Following in your footsteps. Betrayal, indefinite imprisonment, execrable torture at the hands of the Old Father. You didn't deserve such treatment. Did you? I will say my view was a touch better than yours. We found him at the top of a mountain with tree roots wrapped all around him. The only way to free him was to... Well, that. Highly pleasant. For all parties involved. Ah. You okay? The light. It's... It's been so long. There's an outcropping just ahead. The shade will make it easier on your eyes. Come on. You said Ragnarok is coming. Which means Baldur. Baldur is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard. And then he found Kratos at... Anyway, I'd promised to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they'd chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Amir, speak Watch of out! Oh. No, 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 no. It's okay. I've got you. <laughs> all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. If Odin starts Ragnarok, you really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. Before we go any further, the truth. What is it you want from me? You, you speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me. That I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war, or worse yet, lead you to it, then kill me now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tier we need. We need you. for a good night's rest and maybe some food I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner brother perhaps now you'd like to finish the story uh, the sons of Thor attacked us
I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa, what are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ain Hurriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. <clears throat> <clears throat> Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. Look out! You do it! Behind you, father! <laughs> 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 Yggdrasil. It's been too long. I've forgotten. Beauty. Tyr, in your travels, did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are... were... a very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Tree house. Lord Tyr, you're really alive. Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. So, can we talk about what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh, okay. In the morning. You hold still. Yep. <sighs> oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, Tear. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tear. Sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey, come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupting Have a seat any going on. And I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a roof on? Yes, but it's where I keep my room. What are you thinking, brother? thinking. I want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to climb a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so... restless. I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But... Holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His pain is fresh. You expect too much. Ah, perhaps. Pity Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I have to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting an old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. 
<gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it though? How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Jormungandr? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead, so it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So, you know where Freya is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first. And then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. I seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh. You got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No. I could just use some fresh air, is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh, no. I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh. I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but why traumatize either of us further? Okay. Caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Jormungandr's nearby? I know what I smelled. Okay. Well, a lot's kinda happened, and I need answers. <sighs> A chest. Not so easy, huh? Shut up! What are you looking at me for? I gave you the fancy bowstring. True. So, Father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died, but I don't know what he's talking about. Accidental magic? That is disquieting. Accidental magic's not all. I sort of... turned into a bear. A bear? Including the slobber? Yeah, but I lost control. Frey knows magic better than anyone. She could help me. But not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. It's... Shoot the barrel. It's got soundstone on it, too. Yes! Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. For blah. How'd the Arm of Tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. Come huh. 
Looks dwarven. Looks like there's something hidden by the horsemen. If only I had a way to burn this. Yes, if only your father were here. That's not what I said. <laughs> no way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? It is sound stone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. Here's arm. Your father owed Thora blood payment, and well, he got it. Wow, great story. Anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled bear rampage? It's me. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching. Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay. Here goes nothing! That's some quality craftsmanship! A little help would be nice. Uh, okay, right. I'll just... Sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, whatever. the lift switch is broken. You can fix it, can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? <sighs> there! Let's get going. Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look out for the people I care about. It keeps bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. And Jormungandr's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. 
I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you say That's not weird at all. Should have stayed home. Let's head back. Door's frozen. Maybe I can. So what was your plan, anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck! Is that frozen lightning? Don't tell Brock I cursed. He's unbearable when he's smug. Look, Balder tried to kill her. We had no choice. I'm not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. Ha! 
Well, that's quite enough excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh dear. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. I... Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet Bessel, I wish it did. Ha! <clears throat> See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again if that's what you're asking. My shop! Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay here. Fix this. Suit yourself. <sighs> I don't think I can break this. I need to find another way around. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. Hit the fire pot! Stop up! Keep going. Get off of Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan. Brock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. Okay, now which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah, sounds right. Destroy the sonic piece first. All right, I just need to get a different angle on the soundstone. to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. <sighs> Maybe if you listen to me, could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? Ah! <laughs> 
Going up. Wonder what mom would do. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? Going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. Ugh, nightmare. Who's up? 
Jaffa. Freya shouldn't be much farther now. Just need to look out for that big door. there hey come to your senses yet yes I mean uh, I'm not changing my mind ha you do have doubts hey like you never do better than having regrets I'm not sure I agree with that but by all means keep going and you might find those too <gasps> yep that's the door Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. She probably avoid mentioning that. Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh... I'm so dead. Here goes nothing. Freya! You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! He shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this! Take your life on it. What do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? If you mean to plead for your father, save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin. Nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us! Offered peace if we don't move against him! Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Groa's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The Giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In 
in Jotunheim. You learn the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin, and he's already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. But we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Here is alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Swordofine. Impossible! The Nine Realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together... Enough. Enough! Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. Okay, so I'm not dead. I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. Which I will never, ever admit to Sindri. Good thing I like climbing. Oh, thank you, Mia. You're all right. How did it go? I was starting to think... Sindri, I told you. I could handle it. But I don't think she's gonna help us. Ah, uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking and I, uh... got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me. How did it feel to run on chaos? I... I just fixed that! I've still got my bag of tricks. If you need me, I'll be standing back here. Yup! I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way! He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. 
something I've kept from my brother for a long time. Ugh. Do they ever quit? Alfheim Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. <laughs> really? Now? <laughs> Anyway, you did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. What do you mean, a choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Ugh. And I heard it when I said it. All right. Shall we? I hate coming home empty-handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to- Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure you saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. From. You are certain the Giants will not cancel war? 
I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. Is this sausage? Uh, sure. Why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? Uh, Atreus, who are planning our next move? Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim. Home of the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are seeking information. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. You're better than the seer who saw everything. I wasn't sure you, um... Never mind. That's great. I'll find. Hey! Don't go forgetting this what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> More for me. Here, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, Whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. So... Where'd this plan come from? Oh, from the mirror, of course. I was merely asking how you found me. He explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodar Shrine. Fascinating. From there, <laughs> you saw the At which point your father recalled finding drawers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually find the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step to the world's source. Even without feet, he'll forgive the levity. He really did it. Tear really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you? Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. If I take a little peek at you, I promise I'll be brief. My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Well, this must be the squirrel that tends the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squid ink. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait. If you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. Hey. Oh. But you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. 
and a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of, Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off, I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway, now that I've polished off all this regimen for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. So that's why good Master Brock needed an Alfheim seed. Clearly you have important- Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the Land of the Elves. Sure I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever roam traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. I can't leave Midgar. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, Light Elves came back. They seemed better now. <laughs> Did they now? Alfheim. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. See the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yikes. Thimble winter hit Alpha hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Fimble winter. A living desert. Huh? Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. What do you hear? It feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but... The Dark Elves get on best they can.
Perhaps we can reach that brazier from above. The shrine is at the top. Good eye. Bye, Frost Eyes. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just putting on your chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. Ah, very well. <laughs> Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Oh, I didn't know it could do that. of the Vanian traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. There's no need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Whoa! Is that a bar? Behind you! Look at it! We're the ones who freed the life. Yuffa! Whoa! Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus! I hate Alpha! Alright, showing them. Most unfortunate. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us one to it. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend.
Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Tribute to Flair, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, Flair's. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. So tall. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed. I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freya was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, and here. You keep pushing forward. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. Solid Light. Guess some things don't change. <laughs> yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. That sound. No sense in spoiling the surprise. Oh, it's the light. Oh. Ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, the fallen soul began to gather in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the light elves were born. Well done. Though I imagine our Light Elf friends will be less than pleased. Speaking of Light Elves. Let me try talking to them again. They Thanks may... just to let these two do their thing, brother. Enemy on the line! Watch out! 
Here, they came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean we can't disfigure some architecture. This way, shrine awaits. He's just looking around. He does this sometimes. Oh, curious mind. Carry on. The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to attend the temple. And themselves, by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred. None more so than the light itself. Aye. The Light Elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. <laughs> Another of Cavassia's poems. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Oh there, friends! Salutations! We mean you no harm. Tear! Get back! Left side, incoming! <laughs> Using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Hmm. Fortifications. Aye. None too eager to let the dark elves run the roost again. I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. We know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. 
Oh, tricky. behind this crate, right? It worked! Thanks, dear. My pleasure. Explored. Back to it then. Why not simply hold it in place? Yeah, that looks right. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Kvasia. I suppose I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Wow. That was violent. 
I'll meet you on the other side. really jump. This mystic doesn't see us. There's twilight stone in the ground. They come. Do what you must. Find Crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. Oh, the crystals still make light bridges. But now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. Enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? Feels even taller on the inside. And here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Watch your mate!
Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. But that angle isn't gonna work. Yeah. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. <clears throat> Do you still hear something wounded out there? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top. Once we find our way past yet another light door. Maybe if we... Allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Oh, the light of Alfheim. What's wrong? I could hear Mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When Father went inside the light, he said You went he... inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so conversation was difficult, to say the least.
father, she's... She's gone. We're almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this hive stuff up here. So many Dark Elves. I... All this time, I thought the Dark Elf King... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Dear. Yeah. We helped the wrong side. Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. Yeah, but there was a Nornier chest down here last time. <laughs> oh, guess they moved it. <gasps> there it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. Okay. <laughs> At your service. I'll disinfect my tools. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? Have we more to talk about? The giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he heard, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim. 
while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look, here. This is what we saw. It's you, fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't... I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? Other realms thrive. And Odin dies. She lied. Roa lied. Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin! We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay, whoever that is doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, him. Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. But we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. 